Saturday um, and I decided to come and give you a look at what my hair looked like after a couple of days um, after using the, these two products. Um, let me just go ahead and apologize. You probably can hear a lot of background noise um, because I'm washing my clothes so uh, sorry but I need clean clothes. Yeah. So basically uh, my hair still looks, it's a lot bigger because it always gets bigger as the week goes on, but it essentially looks the same. Um, it held up so good. It still feels so nice. It's not um, even super frizzy. It just kind of, you know, puffed up on me a little, but I actually prefer it when it's big like this, so I'm not mad about that. But basically, these two products work extremely well together. Um, the double buttercream is just very moisturizing to my hair. Um, and I think it's moisturizing enough that it can combat, like, the biggest issue that I had with the Design Essentials cream gel is that my hair felt hard and crunchy. This, I think, softens that up so it doesn't do that. Um, the hold for the Design, Design Essentials is great but you sacrifice softness for that hold um, and this just kind of works to um, fix that so the two of these together I just I'm so happy that I tried them randomly tried them together because it is my new favorite combination um, and I will probably be doing this for a while um, I don't know I've kind of fallen out of love with my wash and goes um, I don't know, I prefer doing this look um, a little bit more than the wash and go. So for right now, this is going to be my go-to and doing the six um, flat twist outs like what you saw. Um, so yeah, these two together, I would definitely recommend. Now I will say, they're kind of pricey, which is why I was really, really pissed off about me not liking the design essentials because I paid I think twenty dollars for this jar um, and I can't remember how much the buttercream double buttercream is but I think it's up there to maybe fourteen fifteen dollars so these are not cheap products let me just say that okay they're not cheap um, but I've had them both for a while I haven't been using them but I mean it doesn't take a lot um, as you saw when I was doing my hair it doesn't take a lot of either of the products to get this outcome um, so using them together I would say that it was worth the money to me separately not so much um, but I really do love them together so that's going to be it for this video hopefully uh, you found it helpful and if these are two products that you already own Hopefully this gave you an idea of uh, some way for you to kind of get your money's worth out of them. Um, if you like this video, I actually have a bunch of products that I have tried out that suck the big one. Um, that I could attempt to find ways to utilize. Um, so I could do more of these matchup videos if it was something that people were interested in. So let me know either by liking this video or leaving me a comment down below. Um, and I will attempt to try to find ways to make Because you know you buy this stuff, you use it the one time and it sucks. You're not going to use it again but it's like I bought this and I can't take this back. Um, so... I probably need to be doing that anyway just so I can get my money's worth because some of this stuff is not cheap. Which is why I'm like really, really careful about what I try because I don't want to like waste my money because it will make me very angry. So, um, that's going to be it for this video. Hopefully you found it helpful. I guess I will see you in my next one. Later loves. Bye.